Hello friends, this is Annette of AnnetteLeonard.com back with another moment of chronic wellness. So glad you're joining me. So glad to have this time. We are talking about the coronavirus and COVID-19 and keeping ourselves safe and protected. And one of the ways that I do that is that I endeavor to not shake anyone's hand. And I got to tell you, this is a social no-no. People rely on shaking hands. Like it is right up there with eye contact for social conventions. The It is a quick way to insult someone and leave them feeling kind of butthurt. <laughs> and, uh, it, it is a profound thing in this culture, the handshaking. And so here is the way that I get out of handshaking. I take on the responsibility and I say, look, I don't want to shake your hand. I've been sick recently. It's not untrue. I've been sick for the last 10 years. <laughs> like, I have been sick recently, like always and forever. And what you don't know is that I'm not contagious but you might be <laughs> and I don't want to shake your hand because you, you I, because I just washed my hands because I just sanitized because I don't know what you're carrying around because I mind everything I touch and I doubt you do <laughs> I'm not gonna say all those things right like none of those things are kind none of those things are helpful none of those things make anybody feel better about themselves and so I say I've recently been sick I'm not gonna shake your hand because I've recently been sick and then people are like oh okay okay like then they don't want to shake my hand and that is just fine I'm not gonna shake your hand because I've recently been sick the mother of all outs I'm not gonna shake your hand because I've recently been sick I actually was at a coffee shop with a woman who was friends with somebody else at the table and there she was this mutual or this new acquaintance to me and she was there eating a muffin and just started like licking every one of her fingers to like lick off the muffin goodness and then got introduced to the rest of us at the table and was like hey nice to meet you and I was like hell no I am not gonna shake that licked up finger licking good hand hell no and so I pulled my line I was like I Thank you. It's great to meet you. I've recently been sick, so I'm not going to shake your hand. And one of the other friends at the table, who's like a New York Jew and just, you know, says things like they are, was like, uh, you were just licking your hand. I don't want to shake it. Thank you. And I was like, yes, I love you for saying that. I did not have the courage to just be that ballsy but in fact you were just like mwah, 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 getting it and no thank you i don't want all your mouth germs all over my hand no thank you <laughs> so, <laughs> there you have it folks don't shake hands and that's at least one way to do it whether or not we're in the middle of a pandemic scare <laughs> or you're just protecting yourself on a random Thursday because you are immune compromised. <laughs> so don't lick all your fingers and then extend your hand to somebody to shake it. That's my pro tip for today. Nobody wants that. All right. I hope you're having a good day. Thanks for being here. Until we're together again, keep your licked up fingers to yourself. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>